Okay. Hey, everybody. Uh, welcome again to the Crypto Mind uh, show on YouTube that's going to try to give you all the information you need, um, especially about crypto news, crypto mining, and any kind of updates that are needed to keep you uh, running as good as possible. Uh, today, we've got uh, news that Gminer, actually, it wasn't today, but today, uh, but Gminer, um, a popular software for mining um, cryptos, especially the uh, it allows the NVIDIAs to do the uh, ETH hash um, and ETC Ethereum Classic, as long as well as uh, a lot of other of the Equihash um, algos and uh, and many other things. Um, four days ago, they came out with a what I would call somewhat critical update. So they have a new update to two. 2.3.1 and um, and it says that it, it fixes some stale share issues on on uh, nearly all algorithms um, and uh, is also helping out a lot in the uh, ETH hash uh, area being more efficient so I was gonna I'm doing a video today about uh, okay so I already have Gminer right um, but now there's a, a new update so I'm gonna go through the process of what you do to update uh, you know, an existing uh, program that you already have. And then how do you, you know, quickly set it up so that you can keep going again. So um, I've got uh, the, right here on the screen, I have the um, G Miner 2.31 uh, update. Uh, and I will have the link to the place where you can go to get it as, as well in the description area of my video. And I'm going to show you how I just go step by step through here and update everything. So I'm I run in, in a Windows environment um, with my and, and actually this is you know this is my little uh, editing mining rig uh, editing box you know my regular tower computer with my uh, Ryzen uh, 3700X and um, I've got a uh, NVIDIA GTX 1070 uh, in there. So, uh, but I, I run everything in Windows, so I'm going to click and download this Windows zip. And then I have, uh, I have a, a, a um, that's wallets. I have a, um, there we go. I have a folder for all my mining programs, so I'm going to save it there. And then I always open it up in the folder. So, you know, you'll see I have, there's Gminer231 that I just downloaded. I had 2.29 before, which means there might have even been a 2.3, but I didn't get the memo on that one. Um, and so here we go. I'm just going to uh, gonna extract all of this. Right, that's where it's going to go. Bam. So now, so now I have, you know, I've opened up 231. But, you know, if I, for example, I was mining uh, Bitcoin Gold with, um, with uh, this program just recently. And if I go and open up the Bitcoin Gold uh, batch file, you know, it doesn't have any of my stuff in here. It has, you know, pre-set up stuff that's that's not my, my, this is not my wallet. This is not any of that kind of stuff. So what I do is I'll go in and I will go and open up the previous uh, version. Oops. And I don't run it. It's going to open up edit. And then this app where I need to kind of, remember to keep things straight but then I'm just gonna go in here and um, and I'm going to just uh, copy and paste the uh, oop, the different uh, parameters in that are the setup that I like for me uh, rise in box
and then I have this extra setup about the electricity cost. So this is one thing I really like about G Miner is that you can um, it, you can set up what your electricity cost is, and mine is seven cents per kilowatt hour out here in New Mexico, and so um, so I can put that in here, and it, it keeps a running total of how how much uh, expense you're you're uh, creating in electricity while doing the mining. So I'm gonna save that. Get out of there. And now I should be able to kick it into gear. Let's take a look. There it goes. Pool.gold. Um, that's that's btg.pool.gold is the one I like to do my uh, Bitcoin gold mining out of. Um, it's a smaller pool, um, and uh, as you'll always hear me talk about, I am a huge maximalist on mining decentralization, and we need to have lots more talks about this in the future, about how we need to consciously uh, start mining, you know, spread out our mining, and not just go to like the most popular pool, um, especially for, you know, reasons of 51% attack and things like that so but here it is and it's up it's running it's going and this is G minor 2.29 I just noticed that right up here so I did not do that right <laughs> I need to close that 2.29 window and go here to 2.31 aye 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 so uh, just to make sure yep that's my stuff alright let's start over here there we go, G minor 2.31. And it's got all of the parameters that I set up. It's already accepted a share. Yay! So there you go. And and um, it can be that quick and easy. And one thing that I, I expressly do is that for at least several versions um, for at least several versions of any program, I will keep a couple of versions back of of uh, the different programs because sometimes um, I've got the setups for the different algorithms uh, uh, or different coins in those older versions. And so what I do is I leave them there. That way, when I want to go mine using the new version and I don't have the latest, I can just go back to one of my... Uh, one of my previous versions and and stick that in so uh, I'm gonna be doing that for uh, that's G minor here for your Nvidia cards <clears throat> and uh, and then I'm gonna for my AMD cards law minor has come up with a significant uh, release that I'm also going to download uh, that's especially helpful for when you're doing dual mining of ethereum and Zilliqua. so so uh, keep that in mind too. If you're, if you are, um, if you are using AMD cards, um, then um, let's see if I can bring it up here real quick. Here it is. Latest minor releases. Uh, One point one six is their latest minor release, um, and it is. Uh, helping out it's got some help for uh, nvidia cards as well um and then um it's added support of eth hash and beam hash 3 for the uh, latest round of amd cards um and there's uh, some other little tricks here too so there's quite a bit done on uh law miner 1.16 a so i would highly suggest that uh that you upgrade to that um right away all right. Well, this has been a this has been the Crypto Mind uh, update report. I look forward to seeing you again for another video. Uh, so keep on hashing, uh, enjoy your day, and stay up to date on this channel with uh, all the latest. Mm -hmm.